Hello everyone, Lemon Tor here. Today I'm gonna to be talking about the story of the game and how long it is and a little bit information about what is going on uh, after the first game and also I'm gonna be talking about the DLC for the future of Dying Light 2 and if you want more uh, information about this game you can check my other videos and if you want new news that comes out as soon as possible uh, subscribe to my channel and I will do my best to inform you about this game so let's start with the story Dying Light 2 is an open world action game set in urban landscape during the zombie apocalypse you play as Aiden Coldwell, a freelancer runner who takes jobs, tasks for people of the city. Uh, one of the last settlements in Europe. Yes, it's a European setting. Uh, former protagonist Kyle Crane was infected uh, with a virus that turned people crazy and unknowingly spread the disease after that. After the global outbreak, modern civilization came to an end, pushing humanity into a new dark age, modern medieval apocalypse. Uh, so it's basically a settlement in Euro somewhere in Europe and it's like a modern medieval apocalypse. Uh, for me these are, these are one of my favorites, the apocalypse version and medieval. The sequel takes place 20 years later where the modern world is a thing of the past. In Dying Light 2 advanced technology is scarce uh, and firearms are hard to come by. You have to scavenge parts together to survive. Uh, enemy factions will try to take what you have. Um, and Dying Light 2 story is around 20 hours, so that, that, that's good for a story, but the entire thing is more than 100 hours of content, so that is amazing because you know you want to do a lot. I think for me it will be more than 100 hours because not I, I like to search for easter eggs and I like to just troll, a lot, troll around with the zombies, experiment with different kind of firearms or weapons or katanas. So I will have a lot more than 100 hours of total content because my god I will search everywhere <laughs> every, uh, for easter eggs and other fun st stuff to do. And also there are pr probably some secret bosses just like in Di Dying Light uh, 1. Alright, let's continue to the DLC. Uh, in an interview with uh, T Timon, uh, lead game designer for Dying Light 2, he confirmed that the game would uh, certainly receive DLC. He claimed that Dying Light 1 was supported for 4 years after its release and the plan for Dying Light 2 is exactly the same. So, uh, here's the thing, they, they released a DLC called The Following for Dying Light 1 and this game was huge and it was awesome. It was like an, an entire game. I mean, it was like Dying Light 2. Uh, for, uh, and I was, like, I was really surprised because there was a lot of things to do and the map was twice, this, um, twice the map of the original one. Uh, so it got me all excited and driving a vehicle through zombies. My God, that was fun. So we're just hoping they will do the same thing for Dying Light 2, which they are promising. And you know they don't disappoint because they did a really good job with the first game. And that is all for today. If you want more information, uh, you can subscribe to my channel. Have a nice day.